Hey, are you ready? We're going to tackle fuel oil tank condition. So be ready your ball pen and paper so that you can write down all the things you will learn today. See you in a little bit. So now I'm going to show you the tank condition table that we're going to tackle. So now this is the uh, fuel tank condition that we're going to tackle. This is only an example, but I will going to explain is the number one fuel oil tank, which is have a capacity of 127 127.57 uh, cubic meter and a corrected sounding of 4.97 and a corrected volume in cubic meter is 109.78 and the SG at 15 degrees is 0 0.9203 and the tank and the tank temperature is 37 and this is we're going to explain how this 0 0.9064 become 0 0.9064 and how this 99.51 becomes 99.51 so keep watching this video until the end i will promise to you that you will gonna learn how to compute this kind of problem so i hope you enjoy watching this and see you hello good morning and welcome to another episode of this channel so once again I'm going to tackle this topic is about tank condition so now I'm going to explain why this tank condition why why this answer of corrected SG and why it's become 99.5 metric tons so we're going to find out how to take the 0 0.90644 corrected SG and 99.50 metric tons that we have a given of SG at 15 0 0.9203 and the volume is 109.78 cubic meter and the temperature is 37 degrees but this given I have already explained I have already read this one a while ago so we are finding the corrected SG and the corrected volume in metric tons. So the formula of this taking this answer, of finding this answer is temperature 2 minus temperature 1 times correction factor which is here the table. We have a correction factor here. This is the specific gravity in the correction factor. We find it, its value of SG for example let's say our SG is 0 0.9203 so we're going to find here because here is 0 0.912 to 0 0.978 the value of correction factor is 0 0.0063 so that's why I'm going to use this 0 0.0063 I am right so let's continue so we're going to minus this 137 minus 15 is equals to, to 22 so this is 22 then we're gonna multiply it to 0 0.00063 this equals to 0 point uh, this marker is no good 0 0.0186 0 so 0 0.01386 you're going to minus it here so 0 0.01386 so 0 0.920 minus 0 0.01386 is equals to 
corrected SG of 0.90644. So that's why in the table I'm show you a while ago is 0.90644. So this is the reason why 0.90644. And now we're going to find out why this 99.50 metric times becomes 99.50 metric times. So we have a uh, uh, given corrected SG now because we, we already find out so 0 0.9064 times the given volume in cubic meter is equals to 109.78 cubic meter so that's why we have 99.50 meters so that's it for today and this is Gerard and I am traveling the world for free